The Albany Firebirds taking on some new players at MVP Arena. Dozens of children and adults with disabilities putting on their game faces today. News 10 ABC's Zion Dakota has more on the event, giving everyone a chance to get on the field. Here inside MVP Arena, it was a special day as more than 80 children, no matter their ability, got the ability to play with the Albany Firebirds. We're going to roll it! Under the Friday night, Wednesday morning lights rather, the children and some adults put on their game faces. You got it, you got it. Be it drills, go, 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 go. throwing and catching, yeah. or even break dancing. They came to get active. That's a good job out of you right there. Great job. Bryce Weiler, co-founder of the Beautiful Lives Project, who is hosting this event, shared what playing with the Firebirds meant to the students. They are able to experience playing football. For some of them, this could be their first time throwing a football or being on a football field or interacting with professional football players. Students like second graders Jazzy and Jordan. And what are you going to tell all your friends when you get back to school? Um, I'm going to say... Um, I have fun with the football team. And do you think you might want to play football in the future or any sports? Yes. He might be a man of few words, but elementary schooler John got in on the day's action as well. What was your favorite part of today? Throwing the ball. The event was a return to the classroom for Firebird Center Sean Lockett, who plays double duty as a life skills teacher in Massachusetts. A lot of them have not been in great situations, um, so if we can come in and just bring a little bit of joy to their day today um, and hopefully just kickstart their weekend and hopefully see some of them at their games, that's what it all means. But it's not just fun and games. Wyler says there's a real message these children and adults can carry for the rest of their beautiful lives. Hey, through these opportunities, it shows the participants that they can do anything they believe in. Now, the event has reached maximum capacity, so much so that Beautiful Lives is planning on throwing more events like this to accommodate more children. Reporting in Albany, Zion Dakota News 10, ABC. You definitely should. That's great. So many smiles to oh, go around there up. today. Yeah.